Hi guys. Hi guys. Okay, let's talk about some environment issues right now. What the hospitality industry currently faces. And some solutions that it might need. Welcome to L'Oreal Tika Talks. Well, over the years, hospitality industry has been growing economically. And it's very rich in providing what the people want and need. But then the pandemic came. Yeah, lockdowns happen which is forced the industry to stop its operations following the safety protocols. But everything comes to an end. The industry is slowly bouncing back, adapting to the new normal, and is currently making more ways to bring back the joy that it brings to people. Yet, there are still issues that it faces. And I mean, in the industry itself. Employment issues means everything that are related to job crisis. Let's talk about a few of them. Well, I think lack of flexibility. And uh, employees in the hospitality industry rarely work a set of schedule and that's a big benefit for many of them. But the flexibility comes with a job is a plus for many people who want some wiggle room in their schedule. But I think unfortunately, this flexibility can also mean employees don't know what to expect between. If they're unsure what their hours might be, the job may actually end up causing additional stress. And employees don't want to wait until the last minute to get their schedules. They also want to have some say in days they have off. But times they are any times they are unable to work and they're expected to work long or overtime hours. Well, this has been something that all of us have personally experienced over the past few years. And as the hospitality industry has dealt with the ups and downs of a pandemic, this lack of flexibility is one of the problems in the new normal today. And by improving your adaptation abilities, you may learn to solve problems, Effect, more effectively accept change, keep an open mind, practice mindfulness, and step beyond of your comfort zone. And when you worry less about what's happening, you have more time to consider on how to proceed and take an action, of course, which increases productivity. And that leads to more time for you to relax and enjoy yourself without worrying. Toxic or unhealthy work environment. Excessive stress at work is one of the leading causes of employee turnover in hospitality. The hospitality industry often has high pressure working conditions that can leave even calm and collected employees feeling stressed out. Not everyone is suited to this kind of environment, causing high levels of turnover. However, not the only reason the work environment may become toxic or unhealthy. 63% of hospitality employees said they've experienced sexual harassment in the job. Furthermore, 9% of employees report that they are currently bullied at their workplace. Toxicity edge up moderately, a greatly adding stress frustration, and other emotional burden day after day. What was a minor annoyance can become an employee resignation in a few months. The hospitality industry needs to provide good and quality social benefits for the employees such as capacity building for them to process the developing and strengthening of the skills, instincts, abilities, processes, and resources that need to survive, adapt, and thrive in a fast-changing healthy work environment. At the same time, the proper orientation of their job description according to their organizational structure. Accuracy for endorsement of possible concerns to be addressed and assisted by your co-worker. At the end of the day, that would be the best collaboration of ideas between superiors and subordinates that will make the work environment healthy and peaceful. Unclear job expectations, not knowing what will. Unclear job expectations, 
Not knowing what they will or should be doing at work can be a serious source of stress for so many employees. If job expectations are clearly communicated beforehand, workers may decide it's time to find a job that is more fulfilling. Employees become unhappy when they experience misaligned expectations. Example, they feel like the job they are doing doesn't align with what they thought they've been hired for. The disconnect causes them to a treat to find a job somewhere else where they are better suited. During the recruitment process, it can be tempting to only show the positive of a job or try to spru spruce up the road to sound more appealing. This approach will only, only paper over the cracks. As soon as candidates realize they have been missold or duped, they quit leaving you back at square one. In this case, by ensuring that you can focus on the unexpected job, just be yourself and try to communicate or suggest how to use your abilities or skills to help, uh, to, help to achieve these goals. There is nothing you can't do. Just do your best even if you don't know how to, to do with your work. Just focus, focus and keep learning. Just ignore the constant racism and hate speech. Always reach your manager. Continue climbing the ladder until you got it. Unclear expectations are just commonplace in your job. The only thing that you can do is learn to be ready to change everything on a moment. And lastly, to top all of our employment issues we have, disconnect with managers. When managers are unable to properly communicate with their staff, it can push employees to quit. Unfortunately, one bad manager can have serious consequences on the job satisfaction of your best employees, which leads to employee turnover. High volume recruitment of leaders, of hotel staff, food servers, quick service restaurant employees, and other service workers need to be able to manage both processes and humans. They need to know how to handle conflict, delegate orders, and communicate openly with both their team and customers. Manager came from the word manage. Your staff depends on you. You are the person they look up to for guidance, process, and they even look up to you as their second teacher, which you actually are. You are in that position because they needed to be guided accordingly. Cooperation and productivity among employees are encouraged in the workplace through healthy manager and employee interactions. As a result, mutual respect between a manager and employee increases both parties' willingness to help one another and produce better work.